We won't have to worry about them not going to breakfast because they don't have any lunch money. Good news for families in Park County. Students at a local elementary school are now able to receive free meals during the day. Good afternoon. I'm Sarah Lehman. In for Susan Dinkle, it's Wednesday, July 31st. It's all thanks to a nationally funded program from the USDA called the Community Eligibility Provision. The non pricing meal service is offered to schools and school districts in low income areas. News 10's Jada Huddleston paid a visit to the Southwest Community School Corporation today. New for you now at 5. She joins us to break down the details of the program and how it's helping families in the community. Montezuma Elementary School has been enrolled in the CEP for three years. Now, Rosedale Elementary School will also be trying the program out starting next week. Today, I spoke with a mother who also happens to be the assistant principal at Riverton Park High School. She says not only is this program beneficial for parents, but also the school corporation. Abby Cleghorn's son attends Rosedale Elementary School. She says knowing he can eat free at school if he chooses to is a burden lifted off her shoulders. Knowing that my kiddo can eat breakfast and lunch every day, even though he's not normally a kiddo that participates in that, that's still something that, you know, if he thinks it sounds good that day, he can try it out and, and see, and then I'm not having to front that money, so it's kind of nice. The program allows all students enrolled at Rosedale Elementary School to receive free breakfast and lunch. Parents are not required to apply for the free meals. Jonella McClintock is the food service director for the school corporation. She says it was crucial to apply for the program in order to help families in need. Over the years, the need is becoming more and more. Being a small rural community, I thought that the community eligibility provision program would work really well in our little rural county. Not only can the program ensure kids aren't going hungry, it's a way to help keep them focused in the classroom. A lot of our kids rely on those morning and, and noon meals to you know, fill their bellies and be successful during the day. So to be able to offer that free of charge is, is huge. Right now, all students at Montezuma and Rosedale Elementary Schools will receive the free meals. The next step, Riverton Park High School. Well, we're hoping that enough people participate so it can sustain itself in the following years. Our hopes is that next year we will be able to add the high school to the program. The CEP is a four-year program. After those four years, each school is then reassessed and must reapply if needed. Coming up at the top of the hour, you'll hear how you can get involved in the program and why it's crucial families take advantage of the free service. Sarah, back to you.